Hey, hello friends, welcome to my channel. In this video, let's see one of the commonly asked coding interview questions, which is nothing but finding if the provided strings are anagram or not. Okay, so first let's try to understand what is anagram. Uh, consider there are two uh, two strings provided. So example say silent and listen. Okay, so whenever I use jumble the first word, okay, so whenever I jumble the first word, I will get the second word. So, you know, S is present here, I is present here, L is present here, E, N, T. So, all the words present in my first string is present in the second string and again vice versa. Okay, so, this is a, this is what we call as an anagram. Similarly, we can see, let's see another example called race or you know, pair. Okay, so, these two strings are also uh, an example of anagram. In case if I change this to another word called carrying. So, now if you note, both these strings are not an anagram okay so pro so this is how uh, this is what the logic of anagram is so let's let's see how we can solve this problem using python coding if so let me there are a method called anagram okay so let's define two strings okay string one equal to listen and string two equal to silent. Okay, for now let's take this example. Silent and listen. Fine. Okay, next our uh, ultimate aim is to find if this string is anagram or not, right? So in order to find if it is an anagram, first if you note the uh, length should be same in both these things so here in this example we have six characters again in the second string we have six characters so our first uh, logic is to find if the length are same so let me check if the length is same okay so if length of string one it will be equal to length of string two okay now so if so basically the first uh, condition for an anagram uh, is to uh, verify if the length satisfies okay only then um, if the the provided strings will be an anagram so if the length are not matching obviously it is not an anagram so that's the first condition and once the length are matching then i have to uh, verify if the characters present in the first uh, string is present in the second string as well okay there are multiple methods in which you can do but the simplest and easiest method uh, in, in 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 terms of space complexity and time complexity is to sort these strings okay so first uh, maybe sort to sort the strings okay so now let's see let let me sort this so let me I'll store it in a start sorted string variable sorted string one equal to sorted of string one so i'm i'm sorting the string one similarly i'm sorting the two as well I'm sorting string two as well and yeah now I have sorted so basically if the sorted arrays are same then probably I can easily say it is an anagram okay so once sorted both the uh, words will be same so I can easily say if sorted Is are same then we can we can easily call it is an anagram so if sorted of string one equal to, equal to sorted of string two then I can easily say then I will print um, string one plus and Yep. 
so else it is not an anagram or not an or not anagram okay so um and finally if the lens are not matching also then probably we can call it as not an anagram right so i'm gonna use a else condition here else if this length is not matching yeah, obviously i'm in this loop in, in this condition i'm just taking the lengths are matching only then i'm going into the if condition but if the lengths are not matching then i'm i'm directly saying it is not an anagram okay so as simple as that when you hear the word anagram you might think it might be, it is very technical but actually not um, getting the uh, finding if the provided strings are anagram or not is quite easy so let me run and show you this yeah now if you see silent and silent are anagram so i have i sorted both okay so i have sorted both okay silent and sorry I think I am not provided it correctly. It's string one and string two, right? So it's string one and string one. Now if I run and see, yeah, listen and silent are anagram. So the provided strings are called as anagram here. Okay. Um, let me provide a space to increase the readability of the output. Let's let let me try with another word like care or race. Now if I run this, yeah, the care and race are anagram. Okay, so um, so this is an example of anagram. Now let me try with a different word, racing. I'm using something called racing here. So it will now compare both the strings care and racing. Obviously, it is not an anagram. Let me see, yeah, now it says care and racing are not an anagram okay so this is how you will find uh, if the provided strings are anagram or not so please go ahead and try this and if you have any queries please po post it in the comment section i'll try to answer it as soon as possible if you like my channel please subscribe to my channel thank you